What's up my friends? We're here cruising in the car. Portland, Oregon. Beautiful day. It's Veterans Day weekend, Saturday. We're here with Chris Chris Kramer, CEO of Somi. He's uh, giving me a nice little tour of the city. So we're checking out how beautiful it is here. I mean, the people are beautiful. The greenery is beautiful. It's got a nice crisp fall weather vibe. All the all the leaves and the trees and it's it's you know it's it's given me some inspiration from a marketing point of view of you know how I can take that and harness that energy and you know take it back to Vegas and really start cranking away and, and bringing some magic uh, to to the Somi brand so we can let this thing take off like a rocket ship to the multiverse so uh, yeah. it's it's a pleasure to be here and you know learning from Chris and getting some cool insights from from him and, and really just learning you know from from the leader you know and leadership it's it's so important to you know know what where, where the leader stands and you know gain knowledge from uh from people that are more intelligent than you that have done more than you have more experience and i think that's something you know as a you know as a millennial like i respect the older generations I respect people that have come before me and have done many things that I haven't done. And if I can harness that and, and learn as much as I can, uh, it's only going to help me grow to be a better person and also help better the brand and help better others from learning from others like yourself. So I appreciate appreciate uh, you know your time and you know being able to spend it with you here, Chris. It's it's really. Really yeah. cool stuff, man. Uh, I really appreciate having James here, and um, just the, you know, some of the conversations that we're having, um, especially like yesterday. You know, when James got into town, and you know, we spent some time getting situated, but um, we just had like a brainstorming session, and it was pretty. You know, it was it was just like you know we were covering a lot of territory, but really. Um, you know, good ideas, you know, brainstorming about marketing, brainstorming about all the, you know, the, the partnerships. Uh, you know, James is obviously out at these events, connecting with so many people that um, we strategically, you know, have connected with uh, some key partnerships that have developed from the various conferences that James has been able to attend. So it's been really valuable. Uh, I don't know, like, James, yeah. what do you think is one of the most valuable things? Of, yeah, yeah. I, I think the uh, and I think the the conferences have been really fun for me. And you know, you conferences could be either really great or not. I think it's what you make it. You know, and, and for something such as a a brand that's on. Right? Somi is an online platform. So being at these conferences, you're putting it into, you're giving something that's online, you have to bring it into real life and be the face and the person of a brand that's an online brand. So doing cool things, you know, like rocking the Somi swag with the hat and the glasses and the cool shirts, the QR code, you know, that's, that's really fun. People take notice of that. And also to really connecting with people you know everyone's obviously shilling and talking about you know their projects and and you know they everyone's got their angle right everyone has an agenda of why they're at that conference they either want investors they want to you know see what other people can do for them most people are in that mindset oh what can others do for me what can I get out of this person and the way that that we're approaching it is from the opposite angle how can we add value to you and your company? How can we potentially collaborate and partner with you? So we're taking the approach from more of a long-term standpoint of how can we partner? How can we team up and build alliances? Because at the end of the day, yeah, there's a lot of competition. We're all competing you know, in a space such as blockchain and the crypto, which is new. It's exciting. Everyone wants to make a lot of money. Everybody wants to be a part of the revolution. And there's like so much buzz and energy around it. But at the same time, it's that cutthroat kind of ruthless mentality that's going on. It's just the nature of business. And you know what? Like we understand that. But let's bring another approach. And people respond to that. People yeah. respond when you approach them from, from a connection point of view because that's really what we're looking for. We're all looking for connection. We want real connection. 
And if we can bring that to our partners and show that this is the integrity of SOMI and what we're about as our team, that really speaks volume and, and that's the truth, you know? I kind of feel with like blockchain, it, it is more of a family. Like once you come into the blockchain, you know, I know we're all doing different things and there's so much innovation. It's such an early time, you know, we're, we're innovators in, 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 you know, kind of the wild, wild west, so to speak, because we're really rebuilding the, you know, web 3.0. And, exactly. you know, I feel like it's actually more of like one big family, like everybody, is even if you're working on like an app that might be similar or it has the same goals, like we talked to a couple of companies that we connected with that we're just like, you know, we're all about partnership. And um, I think it was D-Tribe. You were talking about okay. D-Tribe today. Yeah. And the, yeah. the guy says, you know, we're still in beta, but we're like, you know, hey, from one tribe to another, we, you know, we invite you to just participate on ours and we'll, we'll promote yours. Yep. Um, you know, we just want to like, we want to see Build how much alliances. value and how much, how many alliances, like it's not about us competing. It's about us just, you know, executing on the vision and also like empowering, you know, the partners and the people that we're meeting at these shows. And there's so many, you know, unique and entrepreneurial uh, geniuses that we're, you know, James is, is connecting with and we're meeting and, um, yeah, there's some really smart, really just innovative people in this space, and that's what's exciting about it. Is that, you know the people here are are truly harnessing that power of, of you know they see the potential of this technology and how it can change the world. So we're at the very beginning stages of something really great, and I'm looking forward to. I mean, think about in 10 years what what it's going to be like. You know, like think about okay, it was just Bitcoin's 10th birthday last week you know around uh halloween that was 10 years 2008 now it's 2018 almost 2019 so like think about the next 10 years what that's gonna look like i mean it's i don't even know i mean things are I moving think, so uh, fast you know tim draper uh stood by his comment that he believes bitcoin will be what Two hundred fifty thousand each yeah. by like next four years. Next four years, yeah. uh, and I wouldn't doubt it. You know, I think that we're going to see so much tremendous growth because there's just such a small percentage of the world's population that really understands what's happening. You know, that if you're watching this video now, you're probably top. You know, part of the top top one percent that really knows and is paying attention to what's happening with the blockchain, with cryptocurrency, and you know the, the transformation that's, that's taking place is so exciting. So I think there's gonna be so much, there's so much potential, so much growth. And um, I mean, we're, I know I keep saying it, we're super excited yeah. uh, just because it's just <laughs> like, you know, spending time with James, you know, he's a key member of our team. Uh, and uh, we are a distributed team. You know, our developers are distributed, our, you know, uh, you know, even our like, you know, our financial people, and you know, we we we're all you know part of a, a core group, but we just you know have a distributed team, distributed offices, and it's great to just connect one on one and and have that time where we can, you know, spend you know more quality, have quality discussions and strategy sessions. So we're going to be doing more of that, and obviously doing videos like this where we're connecting and, and letting you guys in on, you know, what it is we're doing. Uh, and again, we have exciting announcements coming that are going to be like uh, really, really great for the community. And I think a lot of people are going to be like pretty blown away by what we're going to announce. Um, I, agree. I think probably <laughs> at the not at the end of this month, but uh, maybe at the end of December or into uh, into January. So. Anyway, I'll end for now. Looks like uh, James' battery is about ready to, to yeah, go. Yeah, we're so. looking a little bit low here, my friends. And uh, so we'll go ahead and end it there for now. But like I say before, this is uh, the beginning of this awesome content. We're going to get more behind the scenes, up and close and personal. You know, I'll be heading out to Singapore here soon. So Block Show Singapore. Yeah. Watch out. out. Here we go. Huge. Somi's going to be coming through. Somi Squad. And we're going to go over there and, and let them know out in, out in Asia what, what Somi's all about. So uh, yeah. we'll, we'll see you guys real soon. See you guys.